Hey guys, welcome back to Hanging with the Kiddos Creative Creations. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make your own template for these two packs cookie treats over on Canva. So if you're interested, make sure to watch the video till the end. And if you find this video helpful, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. And make sure you hit that notification bell so that you won't miss any of my future videos. Stay tuned. Hi right, guys, so the first thing you want to do is log into Canva. And you want to go over to Custom Dimensions. And you want your size to be 4 by 6 inches. canvas pulls up we're going to create one label and then we're going to save that label and then we're going to go back and add multiple labels to a full size sheet of paper so we're going to be creating the template first you want to go over to element scroll down to shape your first shape, you want it to be 2 inches in height and 3 inches across. You want to center this. Next, you want to duplicate the shape. You want to change the color for now. Now we want to create our size. We want to select our shape again. We're going to make it a different color for now. And this should be 0 0.5 inches. And 6 inches in height. Now that we have created our template, we can start designing. I would definitely make a copy of my template page so that every time when I need to make a new design, I can start with a clean template. You can go up to the upload tab and upload all of your clip arts and different elements and backgrounds that you may want to use in your design. You can go and do a quick Google search to search for any of the logos that you want to use. You would want to search for a PNG image. The image will have a transparent background. I have already uploaded everything that I want to use for this design. You can find all of these on Google. And my, my screen may look slightly different from yours because I have Canvas Pro Edition. I'm able to save all of my different clip arts and folders. But if you don't have the Pro Edition, you're going to see everything that you uploaded under the Uploads tab. And from here, we can start designing. The template does have these different layers, meaning that you can click on each layer to change it. Next, I'm going to create a quick design. I'm going to save my single label, upload it again back to Canva to add multiple labels to a full size sheet of paper. I'm going to print and assemble. Stay tuned.
Now that you save your label, you want to go back to Canva so that we can add multiple labels to a full size sheet of paper. You're going to go back to custom dimensions and you want to put in 11 by 8.5 or you can use one of their shortcut um, option which is going to be the certificate and it is 11 by 8.5. Click create a new design or click the certificate. I've gone ahead and pre-set up my page here. I just added some text and I uploaded my label. Click on your label to add it to your sheet of paper. Now you may have to adjust these, um, the height it should be no more than six inches. So there we have it. Now we have two labels on a full size sheet of paper and we can print and assemble. All right, guys, so I wanted to share with you all a new tool that I picked up off of Amazon. It is a mini bag heat sealer, and it's to help me crump the ends on these small treats. Let me open it up. It comes in this really cute little clear case. I got it off of Amazon, and it was around $13. This is the page that it comes with. And as you can see, I don't know if you can see that, it has the lines in here. It's going to leave those line marks on the paper when I, um, when I apply it here. So I'm going to plug it up and show you how it works. Alright guys, quick tip, do not touch this. It is hot. Like, I wasn't sure if it was hot yet, so I decided to touch it like a fool. And now I have these three lines on my finger. So, it's hot, so I'm just going to show you how it works. So, I guess. And you don't have to hold it long. Okay. There you have it. So this is perfect for little small treats when you can't run it through that big paper crumper. So. Yeah, but it does get hot. And it's not um, taking the ink off or anything. Alright. 
right. I really like this. I'm going to leave a link to the mini bag sealer heat seal. So that's what it's called. I got it off of Amazon. And I'm going to try to link the one that I purchased. But it does work. And it's really good for little small treats like these. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching the video to the end. I hope you all found it helpful. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. You can find the links to everything that I use in the description box down below. If you're interested in the pre-made version of this template, hopefully by the time that I post this video, I'll have it available. If I do have it available, I'll link it down below. Today is Friday, September the 4th, which means I have a freebie for you all. If you head on over to my website in the free printables tab, you can find this week's freebie. And it's this design that I created in this video. You can download it and print it for free today only, September the 4th as a free printable if you're watching this video after today it may or may not be available as a freebie thank you all so much for watching and see you next time bye